Hello everyone and welcome back to Lucky Loaders 15 where I'll be giving you two tips for tomorrow's horse race in action. Before we get into that, just want to reflect on how our only tip of the day ran. In the end, it was a good result at Stratford with Sheldon. Absolutely bolted up on his chasing debut. It was quite a comfortable winner in the end and I hope some of you are on there. He actually drifted out to the final SP a 3-1. to one. So that was a good result for us and yeah, hopefully we can uh, continue to form going into tomorrow's racing and like I say I've got two selections for tomorrow we're going to go to the new market for the first one where we're going with my next best of the day in the 425 going to go here with a horse that's been a bit of a cliff horse of mine this season and that's Torcello for uh, Russell Ryan and Sean Lysett currently available at um, 12 to 1 with Bet365 I'm going to recommend a 0.5 each way selection here now this horse Torcello actually bounced back to some form last time when he finished second at air that was in testing ground and he's really going to uh, should, or he should at least appreciate the unfit conditions at Newmarket tomorrow. He's a previous course and distance winner. He's got form on the Rowley Mile course. And if he gets an easy leader thing, he could just be hard to peg back. And Newmarket sometimes can be a front runner's paradise, especially when the ground's on the soft side. It can be hard to uh, make up ground from uh, coming off the pace. So I think that will serve him in good stead. I think 12 to 1 is a bit of a big price about him. He's fallen down the weights, down to the mark of 84. I definitely think that is within his range. And for me, like I say, I think he can definitely run a good race tomorrow. And that's why he's going to be my next best of the day. We then go to my net, which run, then runs in the weather uh, racing at Savile for the evening there. Um, we go to the 7.15 with my net with a horse called United Front for Jason Watson and Mick Appleby. Currently available at 11 to 2. I'm going to recommend a win-only bet here, a one-point win bet. Now, this horse, United Front, um, I just think he doesn't like the turf. He's not got a very good record on it. He's much happier on the all-weather. He's five wins from 17 starts. And I think this switch back to the Tabita tomorrow, we'll certainly see him in good stead. And Mick Appleby's team are just coming into a little bit of form now. We always know that uh, the all-weather is what they always uh, target because he likes being champion trainer. He's, I think he's been champion trainer on quite a few occasions over the years. And he just seems to uh, get the best out, best out of his horses on, all, on the all-weather. And I just think He's uh, got um got uh, he's on for a good mark here. He's a classy horse. He should, the ground oh, the 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 surface shouldn't be a problem for him, and he's very versatile as well tactically. He can be ridden forward. He can be ridden from off the pace. I just think he's got a really good chance tomorrow, especially over this trip. And yeah, I think he's the one they've all got to be, and that's why he's going to be my nap of the day in the seven fifteen at Savile. So they're the two tips and for tomorrow's racing. If you're enjoying these videos. Remember to hit the thumbs up button, subscribe here to the YouTube channel at Lucky Loaders 15. Please remember to gamble responsibly. I'll be seeing you again.